everybody, Nacelle just got coming to you guys with part 6 of Monster Sanctuary. Part of nothing, because it's just a game. And, anyways, um, we're not strong enough to take on the first serious boss yet. So what we're going to do is we're going to leave and go to some other areas to get some more XP. So to do that, I'm not... I don't remember entirely where we're supposed to go... I think it's up there, but I don't. Can we go there from this way? It looks like we can. We need to do some fighting too. So if any creatures show up, or I guess monsters is what they're called, right? It's monster sanctuary, not creature sanctuary. Um, we'll do that. This is probably my most uh, or least viewed um, playthrough of any game on the channel, but I am still happy that some of you guys are watching it. One episode really did well, and then. Some of them don't, so I guess it depends on what part of the game I'm in, if people are actually interested in it or not. So, yeah, um, anyways, let's see. That one doesn't make it so we can go anywhere. Ah, uh, I see. And then, yeah, okay, nice. We got the skill resetter. Like I said, those are super useful items. Um, I don't know why I need to do this, but... Um, no, I don't have any of that ability. Ah, here we go, the Ancient Woods, exactly where I wanted to go. We can get another waypoint here, we can also look for some new monsters to get. <clears throat> Apparently we could break that wall super easily. Um, yeah. <clears throat> Ooh, these are all rare creatures. We have Diavolas. These guys are pretty cool. So we got a burn off on him. That's pretty darn good. And then Fireball. And he's dead. Now these guys do just a lot of damage though. Holy cow. Got lots of bleed. Can you guys stop attacking the guy in the middle? Like, what did the guy in the middle ever do to you? Okay, he should be dead because of the burn. And we don't really have anything to deal with this guy in the middle. Can you guys stop killing the guy in the middle? <clears throat> like, why, why, why the poor guy in the middle? Sadly, we didn't get an egg. Uh, though we did get a new skill point on you. So what's this? Increases attack for max health. That sounds super useful. Not gonna lie. Though, we do have this ability, I'm pretty sure, with you. Oh, yeah. My only issue, um, is actually hitting them. <laughs> so now that we know that's there, we should be able to... Really? There we go. Boop. Uh, uh. <clears throat> this is such an annoying little jump to make. Toledo, man. There we go. And it's a pair. <clears throat> All that for a pear. Just a piece of fruit. I'm fine with fruit in real life, but that sounds like a terrible reward. A cocoon! That's actually used to evolve another creature in this game that we don't have yet. At least I don't think we do. <clears throat> I apologize for the clearing of the throat still from all my other recordings today, but my lord is my throat just dying. And I have a few videos left to record, so yeah, let's continue on. We'll attack the guy in the middle because, yeah, we can. And boom. As long as this guy doesn't keep attacking the guy in the middle, we should be fine. Ugh. Fireball. I just realized we got the burn on both of them. That's pretty good. So we're going to switch into you just to poison the guy in the back. And then just try and gun down this guy right here. Oh, they got some kind of like self recovery thing going on. They're going to destroy the guy in the back. No. Poor guy in the back. Ugh. Oh, never mind. We got them all. And we didn't get a single egg again. Why does this game hate me so much with getting eggs, man? Oh yeah, that's that fall spot. I believe that brings us to the fiery area, the volcano again. Uh, which is cool. Oh, I know. Yeah, you levitate. I forgot about that. What do you do? 
Earth orbs? Okay. I guess that's cool. And we want the Tengu again, because we got more torches. And we got an item up here known as the Level Badge. Super useful when we get weaker creatures. We don't have the ability to get up there yet, because we don't have any of the flying abilities. As I've indicated before, we do get specific flying abilities later on. Um, those ones are... Remember the Fomagis that we see in, like, the Mushroom Mage? Yeah, that's, a, that's another one that we can... Uh, get for that. I believe that's actually the only way you can deal with that. Oh, Diavola again. I think this is three of them. Yeah, it is. Burn. Destroy. Nuke. Essentially, these guys don't even get to attack, because they're pretty weak. Oh, we burned the guy in the background, too. Ooh, they got buffed up pretty hardcore from that, but oh well. Let's beat these guys up just a few times. Ooh. There we go. Ooh, we got a Diavola egg. Not too bad. So we can go in here and hatch the Diavola. Uh, your name will be uh, Venus. Because it's a Venus flytrap, right? It makes perfect sense. Now... Um, I want to switch you for you. So, going over skills, let's see what we got. Um, let's see here. Uh, are you physical or magical? You're physical, so we'll get the leaf blade attacks, because those are pretty good. Uh, that's magical. Ooh, having regeneration on our team will be really, really good. Um, ooh. A buff to our shields, that'll be pretty good. Then we can also get some attack, we can get bleed, get some health, and some defense. I think that'll be good, so you'll buff up. So I think I'm going to switch you out for Tengu, honestly. And then we're going to do you, and we're going to give you... I think we're going to give you the goblin ability, just in case we get the goblin. So we can also go here and use the level badge on you. Which will then give you another skill point. And in this case, we're going to go with the multi-weakness, because having multiple stacks of abilities is just super useful. Uh, I think we need the uh, the hover ability. Is it hover or fly? I forget what it's called. Levitate? Maybe levitate, honestly. I'm pretty sure this way leads us to the... Um... So what is this power? It's the levitate big boulders again. Uh, corn. What's with all the food in here? Just corn. This is not porn. Oh, another chest. Let me guess food? Hazelnut, yep. I'm dead on with it being food again, that's for sure. Oh, let's fight these guys and see what we got going on here. Uh, I think we'll take on the dragon guys first, because they seem to be the more annoying ones to deal with. And then we'll attack. Here we go! That bleed damage is useful, not super strong. Ah, oh, it died. Now I'll attack you, and we'll apply the regeneration ability, which is super useful. Do watch. Not the most useful ability in the game, but definitely better than nothing, right? Oh, we didn't get the burn. That's what's screwing us up this time. No burn again, really? That's annoying. There we go. And we just gotta do the exact same thing to this guy. Actually, I think they have an ability on that prevents burn from not happening. At least that's what it seems like, doesn't it? Huh. Alright, we should win this turn, though. And we do. Nice, nice, nice. We win. Good. Also, fun fact, that little lizard thing is actually a dragon, and it can evolve into a decently strong uh, creature. It's more useful with, like, specific teams and grapes. This is literally food well. Ooh, a rack lichen. Is that lava blob? And virtrag. Okay, of course it's virtrag, right? Okay, we'll do long slash to hit the guy in the middle. 
And we can do Aqua Blast on you, and then we can do, I guess this, just on him to get the extra damage. Oh yeah, the shield. Alright, I'll take on this spider guy right here, and we'll go with re restoring shield on myself. Oh, I don't even... Oh, God almighty. I think we're going to have to retreat. Um, I just don't think we have the power to deal with them yet. Wait, this leads back to the, the Stronghold Dungeon. With mini tours. And Ninkinanka again, which is weird. Just any XP is good XP at this point, that's for sure. Yeah, those guys are buff appliers. Ooh, ow. Like I said, these guys just do a lot of damage, holy cow. Alright. At least the Minotaur is down. Oh, god almighty. Lightning Slash, that attack, that attack. I'd like both of your eggs, please, though. You can actually get multiple eggs. This is very rare that you would actually get multiple eggs. Huh. Alright, he should at least survive. And then I think we're, we're gonna switch back into him and put this on you. Because you have another status ailment on you. Oh, there we go, we got the burn. And the bleed, that's what I'm talking about. Now we can just take him down. Ugh. Oh man, we only got one star from that. That was just god tier awful. Oh my lord. Got some bronze though, that's pretty cool. I like bronze. And we can't do anything there. Anything in here we can do? Ninkinaka and one Minotaur. Okay. I think what we want to do is we want to go with you first. You second, and then you. Alright, so let's just do this. Get nothing off on you. We got the double burn, which is great. Now let's attack the guy in the background. We'll attack you. And then we'll attack you. There we go. And then we'll use the Restoring Shield on our Merman back there. Hoping to spread the burn a little more than we did, but we didn't, so that sucks. Oh, you actually killed him! That's a bummer. Okay, he should die to that, though. And you die, too, which is even more sucky. And these enemies, man, they're just getting brutal. Well, at least you're down. And we got another upgrade on him, so... Ooh, his defense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Now he's even more offensively stronger. Okay, and we've already looped around. So I don't know how much we're going to be doing in this episode other than just doing some exploring in the forest, but... I know, I genuinely like this game. I find it oddly addicting. The graphic design, the graphic style of pixel art is really cool, but at the same time, it's not like overly difficult either. And I kind of want you to go first, like that, something like that, so we'll go with Lifeline. And then we'll go with the Aqua Blast. And we'll go with this to not get the burn. I was hoping to get the burn, but we didn't. And I'll we'll apply this again. Then we'll go for the Aqua Blast once more, and then we'll go for the... Oh, there's the Double Burn, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, the poison back there is annoying, so we're gonna have to go for this. Oh, we didn't get rid of the poison though, that's a bummer. And then hopefully, take down the Blob good. We took down the Blob, so that's one creature down. And then we gotta heal up ourselves. Perfect. There we go. 
The shield that guy gets is super annoying, honestly. There we go. We got rid of the poison this time, though. There, we got some bleed damage. Is that guy gonna only do the... Alright. That guy in the background's gotta die. Oh, he's got the uh, aging buff. I don't think we can win this. I don't think it's even physically possible that we can win that because that guy's got that buff. So we're gonna have to come back. We do need a better team. Okay, I think maybe we can take these guys on since they don't have the Virtrag this time. So go with, go with you guys, then we'll go with the Lifeline, obviously, to have the buff. Then we'll go with the Aqua Blast to do as much damage as humanly possible, and then get the double burn. Perfect. Then we'll heal up and shield ourselves. There we go, we got the burn and poison. The only issue is burn on fire enemies doesn't do anything. Now the Diavola just keeps getting murdered, because like the things around here just seem good against them. Which sucks, but that's just how this game's gonna work, right? It's all random, so nothing we can really do. Alright. Trying to spread the burn to the other guy, but oh god. Oh, that's a bummer. That's a real bummer. And we didn't even get the, um, what's it called? The, the bleed. Huh. Get the bleed. No, no bleed. Okay, he didn't go for the shield, though, so that's pretty good. And there we go. We should be able to, for the most part, beat this guy. So we'll heal up, and then we'll also heal up on him, and then that'll give us enough mana to be able to- how do we poison him though? How the heck did we get the poison? Huh. And there we go, we beat it, nice. And we got a monster bell, what monster bells do is those instantly summon enemies that you just defeated back. Oh, these guys we can beat, though. So go like this and just activate Lifeline, and then go for the fire shots on the middle guy here, and then stab him. But see, the Diabola is just honestly really weak. I might just ditch him, because he doesn't seem that strong. And you'll die, so that's good. And... Did not mean to use that on the middle guy. I meant to use it on him, because... For some reason, they like killing my Diabola, so... And we'll go for the Restoring Shield on him. Alright. There we go, we got the burn. The burn on both of them will greatly help our cause. And then I want to attack with you first. You should die to the burn damage, so that's good. And now you guys should both die. There we go. Perfect. That was way better. And we got a Ninky Egg. We got a bunch of level ups. So first of all, let's see what we got for skills on you. What's this one? For every 40 mana to regenerate, a gain a charge stack. Um. Honestly, every attack trigger... Ooh. That's not bad. We'll go with that one because it's more damage. And then for you, we'll go with... Yeah, that's pretty good, too. And then for you, we'll go with Gemstone Rain level 3. Um, Jewel Blast. We'll go with Restoring Shield level 3. Ooh, Snow Veil. That's pretty cool. And then some magic, I guess. I think I kind of want to use maybe uh, you instead of him. And then switch them so they're like this. Maybe, I don't know, I think that seems to be more reasonable. Having the defensive wall there be like our uh, protector. Plus shields are always super useful. Right, I kind of want to get to the che like the, the teleporter before we end the episode. Oh, these three, of course. Yay.
We'll put Restoring Shield on you. And then we also get a, a partial shield from that. We'll attack you with that. And not get any burn damage. The only issue with bleed damage is bleed damage ends at the end of the turn. So that's a thing that happens. Uh, and we don't have anything to do with you. That sucks. We got the chill though. I guess the chill. Oh my god. Um, alright, we're gonna use our la one of our last smoke bombs to dodge these guys, simply because they seem to be... They're just strong, we don't have anything good against them. And there's our teleporter. So, anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, please remember to leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications, join the Discord and Patreon in the links below, and I will see you guys next time. Bye bye